Hello, welcome to Faith Academy's middle school presentation. My name is Hans Kollenbrander and I am the principal in middle school. The mission statement of Faith Academy's middle school is to foster growth and development of the whole child with a biblical worldview through active, purposeful engagement and authentic connections between staff, students and learning. In this presentation, I would like to unpack this mission statement through our core values. First, Great Commission Partnership. All of our teachers are missionaries that have been uh, seconded to Faith Academy through various mission organizations in the country. We serve missionary families in their call to ministry by providing education for their children. We also provide education for children of pastors and local ministry workers and other local families. For our educational program, we seek partnerships with local ministries for outreach and fundraisers. And each grade in middle school participates in two ministry outreaches per year. Uh, students organize fundraisers to support these local ministries. And lastly, we partner with the parents of our students to support and provide an excellent education for each child. Excellence in education is our second core value. And our middle school aims to focus on the whole child by providing a variety of subjects. Our core subjects are math, science, English, social studies and Bible. And then uh, students can choose subjects from a variety of electives to develop their skills and interests through choir, band, strings, computer, robotics, Mandarin, home economics, art and physical education. In our after-school program, we offer various opportunities for extracurricular activities in our clubs. For example, architectural design, calisthenics, music, drama, academic competitions, games, arts and crafts, or sports. And then, once a week, students meet in their advisory group. A small group of students with an assigned mentor, their advisory teacher. The focus of the advisory program is on social and emotional development, acquiring study skills to help them become self-directed learners, and a focus on spiritual development and discipleship. We want to be intentional in focusing on the positive behavior of our students, and therefore we adopted elements of the PBIS approach, the positive behavioral interventions and supports. This enforces positive behaviors of students in school by affirming and encouraging when they meet expectations and contribute to a positive school atmosphere. And then one of the highlights in middle school is our week of outdoor education. Students proactively learn outside the classroom by being exposed uh, to God's creation, whether it is the beach, mountain, jungle or on an island. During outdoor ed, students engage in a different way with classmates and teachers and there is emphasis on spiritual growth as well through speakers, small groups, uh, chapels and worship services. Here are a few impressions of life in middle school. The after school sports, after school clubs, drama and musicals. the choir concert and the bands and strings concert and outdoor ed and chapel. In our education, we seek to build our curriculum on the Bible as our foundation, not just a Christian sauce over our lessons, but God's kingdom truths and biblical values permeating the classes, the lessons and the curriculum. We want to challenge students in critical and creative thinking, teaching them to utilize their God-given talents for His glory as an act of worship. We offer various opportunities for spiritual development. Every Wednesday, students can participate in FAT, pursuing holiness and truth. This is discipleship in small groups, and they spend time together around God's Word and just by having fun together. All middle school students attend a chapel service on a weekly basis with a speaker and worship time. As I mentioned before, we introduce our students to ministry opportunities to develop faithful stewardship through outreaches and fundraisers. Our last core value is being a multicultural community. Students at Faith Academy grow up among 
classmates from more than 20 nationalities. They are exposed to a variety of cultures and perspectives, which teaches them to become skillful communicators and proficient collaborators, learning to communicate effectively to people from different backgrounds. As a community, we want to celebrate God's creativity in diversity. And yes, of course, oftentimes this involves good food from various cultures. If you are interested in Faith Academy and you would like to know more, or if you have additional questions, if you would like a campus tour, please contact us through our website or social media. I'm looking forward to your questions. Thank you for watching. God bless.